Hi guys, welcome back. We'll have a look at Disappear by Biba Doobie and I'll show you guys exactly how to play the song. So um, let's get started. I have got plenty of Biba Doobie songs by the way and I'm covering. So let me know what other song you want to learn by Biba Doobie. Now for this song, let's talk about the tuning which she uses for the actual song. It's basically dad fat. I won't say fat, it's like more of like F sharp add. So, you go D, A, D, F sharp, A, D. Let me quickly break it down. Uh, I hope you have a tuner. If you don't have, you just got plenty of apps. Just search chromatic tuner and get it. Otherwise, you can have like an inbuilt tuner like mine. So, top string, tune whole step down to a low D. A string as it is. D string as it is. G string tuned a half step down to a F sharp. The B string tuned to a whole step down A. The high E string tune a whole step down D. So you can say open D because it's a D major chord when you're strong. These are the notes which we have in a D major chord. So let's put the keyboard on fret 4 after that, and that's exactly will make us be by doobie. So um, I'll be referring every fret number according to the keyboard, which is on fret 4. So I'll count this as fret 0. This will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and so on. It goes on so keep on fret 4 let's learn the intro and the verse we have like a E minor shape I have index and middle finger I'll put it on 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 fret of A and D everything else open then I'll play 11 fret on A and D then 9 fret on A and D we got now you have seven fret on A and D so so nine eleven seven so nine, eight, ten, ten. now you have fourth fret on A and D rest all open like the other chords we will do this In fact, this is a strength pattern which we'll be using for the whole song. It's one, two, three, four, and super straightforward. It's basically down, 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 up. So down, 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 up. So one, two, three, four, and so we got. Do the strength pattern thrice on the fourth fret. Nine, eleven, nine, seven, four, four. That's a verse. So you play the fourth fret thrice and then you just do one dance trick on 9, 11, 9, 7. Now coming to the pre chorus, it goes to second fret on E, E string muted, D string second fret, G string second fret, open B and open E. I'll play the strength pack twice for this chord shape. This is the pre chorus. Then I'll play open. So I'm not using my left hand. Again, play the strength pattern twice. So, so we got the pre-chorus. It's repeated twice. So we got. And after that, it goes to the chorus. And over here, the chord progression will be. So. I played second frets on E D G E string muted and the open B and open high E. So now I'll play uh, seventh fret on E, seventh fret on D, seventh fret on G. E string is again muted, but we got open B and E. And after that, after that, the next chord will be open zero. So I'm playing string pan twice on every chord. We got two, 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 seven, open, open. Play the strength pad twice on every chord. Just a minute, just a minute. Yeah, you should be playing the strength pattern once on every chord, not twice. So we got second frets, second frets, open. One time. And 
Then we have like a small uh, post chorus bar where we have this thing going on. So over here, I'm playing every string open. I'm also playing the string pattern once for every chord. But I went four, seven on E. Then I went eleven on high E string. And then again eleven on high. E. So we got down, 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 seven. Down, down, eleven. Eleven. Guys, that's it. That's the whole song. That's how you play Biba Do with the Serpia. Now, I hope the video helped you out. For more easy, straightforward, and accurate lessons like this, make sure you subscribe. I'll see you guys back in the next video. Until then, bye.